So right now we're getting a look at newly unsealed video in the case of a Northern Virginia DoorDash driver who shot a prank YouTuber at Dulles Town Center. So the man who opened fire was acquitted on the most serious charges last week, a jury siding with his argument of self-defense. And now for the first time, we're seeing the brief encounter that led up to those shots being fired at the mall. Just 20 seconds, 20 seconds from the moment YouTube prankster Tanner Cook first approached Alan Coley and the moment Coley shot Cook in the stomach. This was the key piece of evidence in the case that jurors considered when acquitting Coley of the most serious charges of malicious wounding. The full five minute video shows Tanner Cook scoping out victims of his prank, playing odd and explicit messages on his phone. He then approaches Alan Coley, who was picking up a food delivery for his job with DoorDash. Coley tells Cook to stop several times and threatens to call police. Then a huge escalation, and in just 20 seconds, he pulls a handgun out of his pocket and shoots Cook in the stomach. Cook, who has since recovered, reacting to our Matthew Torres about the not guilty verdicts last Thursday. How disappointed are you about this? So I really don't care. Plan. I mean, it is what it is. It's God's plan at the end of the day. So You know, we respect what the jury says, um, and my family and I are just grateful and thankful that I have my son here and nothing else matters right now. That was the first time I seen the video. Um, no mom wants to see their son be shot by a complete stranger in an occupied place. It was very shocking and um, very heart wrenching. Tanner Cook also telling WUSA 9 this incident won't stop him from making more YouTube videos. Opinion about his content on YouTube. Do you agree with it? I support Tanner in whatever he decides to do and I'm going to continue supporting him. Now the jury did find Coley guilty of a charge related to firing the gun in the mall, but that particular verdict was set aside and is going to be reevaluated since he was acquitted on the other charges.